Hey everybody, Dan from Mon One here. I'm back with another sneak peek. Now we're going to talk about Brilliance AI inside of Browse. Brilliance AI doesn't just live inside of Edit. You can actually access it in Browse. It's perfect for getting your photos ready to do your processing, especially for big jobs like uh, senior photos or weddings. It's a great way to speed up your workflow. So here we are, we're inside of Browse. I've got some photos from a wedding and I want to add Brilliance AI to all of them. So I'm just going to select all, that's Command A or Control A on your keyboard to select all of them. And then over here on the right, you'll see there's a new Brilliance AI pane inside of Browns. All I simply do is toggle it to on. And now it's going to add Brilliance AI to every one of those photos. So that means it's gonna go through, it's gonna fix the tone and color in every photo, it's gonna add no noise if it needs it, it's gonna do portrait retouching if it needs it, it's also gonna identify common regions like people and sky and water and flora and adjust those for me automatically. And I can control that in a batch fashion from this pane as well. If I roll down the local adjustment section, I can turn that on and off. That's what's gonna do those regional adjustments to the things like the sky and the people and the water. And in the options section, I can control the white balance and no noise and the retouching for me automatically. So right now I have it set to automatically adjust the color to automatically add no noise when it's needed. I didn't have retouch faces on, so I can just turn that on. Now it'll go through those photos and it'll find any large faces and automatically retouch them for me automatically. How crazy is that? And really, that's as simple as it is. There's not much more to it. Just select your photos, turn it on, configure it to your taste if you want to. Now on all of these, all of the settings you've done are completely non-destructive and re-editable. So for example, if I click on this second photo and I go into edit, we'll see the Brilliance AI is automatically added. If I press the preview button, you can see the before and the after. It's fixed the tone and color for me. It's brightened it up. And if we look in the local adjustments, we can see that it's automatically detected all the flora and made it more green. It's made the people pop out and I can adjust the sky and the water independently too. So maybe I want to darken that sky just a little bit more. Maybe I don't want the water quite so blue and maybe I want those people to pop out even more just like that. Brilliance AI is like a fast forward button in your workflow. It does all the heavy lifting raw processing for you so you can get straight to the fun part, the stylization with effects and layers. There you go. Thanks for watching.